The Wagner Home Decor Paint Sprayer is the perfect solution for a great finish on all of your home decorating projects. Spraying takes about half the time of hand painting and creates a smooth and even finish with fewer coats and no brush marks. The Home Decor Sprayer works with chalk type paint, milk paint, and most other decorative paints in addition to stains, clear top coats, and lacquers. Horizontal, vertical, or narrow patterns allow for easy spraying on dressers, chairs, patio furniture, cabinets, pretty much anything in your home. In addition to the spray pattern controls, the Home Decor Sprayer comes with an easily adjustable paint flow dial, allowing you to save paint. The motor is housed in the base of the unit, so the weight is on the ground, not in your hand. With a six-foot hose and lightweight spray gun, you can easily maneuver around pieces as well as into small spaces and tight corners. The Wagner Home Decor Sprayer is compact for easy storage, and it has the power to handle small to large size projects. Cleaning is simple. Use either the quick clean method when switching colors, or the complete disassembly method when the project is done and storing the sprayer. With the Wagner Home Decor Paint Sprayer, you can paint like a pro and achieve a flawless finish for any decorative piece in your home. Setting up your Wagner Home Decor Paint Sprayer is easy. Remove all the components of the sprayer from the box and carefully read the Quick Start Guide and Manual. We recommend saving both for future reference. Chalk type paints, milk paints, and other thicker decorative paints may need to be thinned to achieve consistent spraying and a smooth finish. Transparent and semi-transparent stains, clear top coats, and lacquers don't require thinning. To set up the spray gun, unscrew the container from the gun and pour the paint or stain into the container. Use the fluid ounce guidelines as a reference for thinning. Try to fill with paint to one of the lines, then add water to the next fluid ounce measurement. For deep colors, like brown and red, add water to bring the level up two measurement lines. If using an oil-based paint or stain, use mineral spirits to thin, and add about half as much as you would water. Thinning at these levels will make the finish smoother and will not harm the paint or stain. It's okay to add thinned paint back into its original container. The suction tube can be aligned for upwards or downwards spraying. Once the suction tube is adjusted, screw the container back onto the spray gun. Then attach the smaller end of the hose to the base and the larger end to the spray gun. You're now ready to start your project. Before you start painting, make sure to properly adjust your Wagner Home Decor paint sprayer. There are two main controls that determine the width, orientation, and thickness of the spray pattern. Turning the dial on the back of the spray gun will increase or decrease the amount of paint spraying from the gun. Turning the material flow dial to the right will deliver less paint. Turning the dial to the left will deliver more paint. We recommend setting your material flow while practicing on the spray poster or piece of cardboard. Once your material flow is adjusted, set your pattern by turning the air cap ears on the front of the spray gun. When the air cap ears are in the up and down position, your spray pattern will be horizontal, meaning that you should move or spray in an up and down motion. Positioning them in a horizontal position will result in a vertical spray pattern, allowing you to paint in a side-to-side -side motion. When positioned diagonally, the result will be a small round spray pattern. This pattern is ideal for small or narrow painting, like chair legs and spindles. Again, we recommend practicing your spray patterns on cardboard or the poster prior to painting. Once your material flow and spray patterns are set, there are three things to remember when spraying. Number one, Get the sprayer closer to the surface. You should be three to six inches from the surface you're spraying. Number two, spray in full passes, not short waves. Number three, spray in light coats to prevent dripping. A lighter coat followed by a heavier coat will result in a smooth, even finish. There are two ways to clean your home decor sprayer. The quick clean method is best for fast cleaning during color changes. 
First turn off the motor, disconnect the hose and unscrew the cup. Empty any remaining material back into your material container. Clean the cup and suction tube in the sink. Make sure to clean the vent hole on the suction tube with a toothpick. If the hole is plugged, the spray will be poor or stopped altogether. Refill the cup with the appropriate cleaning solution. Water for water-based materials, mineral spirits for oil-based materials. Screw the cup back onto the gun, attach the hose and turn the power on. Spray the cleaning solution through the gun and into an empty container. This will clean the interior of the gun. When the solution spraying from the gun is clear in color, the gun is clean. You can then dispose of the unused cleaning material and move on to your next color. The disassembly cleaning method is recommended prior to putting your sprayer into storage. Turn the motor off, disconnect the hose, Unscrew the cup and empty the remaining material back into the container. While at the sink, clean the cup, suction tube and container seal. Unscrew the connecting nut and remove the air cap, nozzle and nozzle seal. Rinse all pieces thoroughly with the appropriate cleaning solution. A small cleaning brush is provided to assist with cleaning. Make sure to clean the vent hole on the suction tube with a toothpick. If the hole is plugged, the spray will be poor or stopped altogether. When reassembling the spray gun, make sure the groove in the nozzle seal is facing outwards. Also, make sure the tab in the spray gun head is aligned with one of the notches in the nozzle. Then, connect all the nozzle pieces to the sprayer. Both methods will clean your gun effectively but the disassembly method ensures no paint or stain dries on internal components of the sprayer. For painting tips and in-depth instructions, refer to the Home Decor Sprayer Owner's Manual, call our customer service at 800-760-3844, or find us online at wagnerspraytech.com.